Hey everyone, it's Nicole Spore for Plan With Nicole and today I wanted to share my washi tape shop haul. I'm super excited about this. I've actually had it for a little bit and I filmed another unboxing and it was horrible because um, I had to unpackage all of the washi and it took forever. So I've unpackaged it and I want to show you what I got. I am a new affiliate with the washi tape shop. So if you see anything here that you like or you want to check out the washi tape shop, I would so appreciate it if you would use my link down below. So this is the super cute little card that came with my order. It's just a little thank you card. It has these darling kittens on it. I didn't buy the cat washi and I'm so regretting it and I think I probably will place another order because it's really cute. My son, my oldest son, um, has two cats that I cat sit for him whenever he's gone and I absolutely love them and I just thought this would be really fun when I send him cards especially maybe that I could t uh, pop because some of them are washi tape stickers that you can pull off and put uh, like I'm thinking on the flap of envelopes, but I also would love to use this in my planner. And I think, I mean, this is just such, such cute imagery. Anyhow, so that's the packet or the little card, pardon, that comes with that. Next, I'm going to share the set that made me buy, uh, made me pull the trigger and place my order. This is a Christmas Carol. Oh, and I've peeled this up once. I suppose it's going to give me fits again. Hold on real quick. I love having nails, but there are times when nails are not your friends. So let me... Maybe it's here. Yes. Okay. So this washi, which I see my little house tour. That's okay. There's more. This is super cool. So this washi could be used as is, I suppose, but they're stickers. I'm going to show you on that one that's torn a little bit, even though I think I can probably do sticker surgery and salvage this guy. So you can peel them up and build darling little scenes. So there's little houses and all of that in this little snowy scene. And then of course, we've got our snowman and bunny. And look at this bunny. Presents, envelopes. It's just so cute. And then, of course, it repeats. I thought this was precious. I absolutely loved it. And this tape right here is what caused me to place my order. But I'm so glad I did. I've been thinking about it for a while. Um, and um, I just love washi. So this is really, really cute, and I'm going to be using this on a spread soon. So there is that. This comes, again, this is a four-piece set of washi, and it's called A Christmas Carol. Let me go ahead and show you the rest of them. This also are little stickers. So like little, little Santa here. The reindeer. I mean, how cute. And I tore that one. That's why it's missing. But lots of cute little critters, little images, Santa, Rudolph, Darling. So this is just a different kind of colorway and of course different images, different size, scale, all that good stuff. But really cute. And I think they can be used for card making and planning. I know this is my planning channel, but I do have a, a card making channel, which is my regular full-time job. And I just think these will be really, really cute on the flaps of like, I always put washi on the flaps of my envelopes when I'm mailing out cards. And I think these would be cute. So here are some more. And of course I did peel those up, but here, let's just move on. Like, I think this elf and the Santa from the last one would be cute together in the sleigh. Oh, that mug. Look how cute the images are. Just love it. So that is the third one in this four-piece set. And then our final one are these hearts. Let me see if I can... Oh, it's right here. I 
I'm using my Spellbinders tool in one because I feel like it's got the sharpest tip and I can maybe save my washi. <laughs> but maybe not. <laughs> Alright. Literally, you guys, this is why I had to refilm this. Here we go. And of course, they're heart stickers. I love that. I think there's so many ways you can use these. And I especially think these would be cute on flaps of envelopes too. Um, also, decorating your planner in all kinds of ways. So that is a Christmas carol. And I am going to just set that aside. Uh, before I go through the rest of my washi, I'm going to... I have my little checklist here. I wrote down the names so that I would make sure and get them right. This is some stickers. So I'm going to show you the stickers and then I'll show you the rest of the washi I bought. This is the Autumn Light Washi. I know it's not autumn. I know it's a long ways from there, but I'm always drawn to autumn images. And so I picked these up for use next year. I mean, look at those leaves in the mushroom. Here's some more. I mean, so pretty. I loved the deer, the pumpkins, I mean, oh my goodness, you guys. And then some more sweet critters, deers, and fox, and birds, and owls, and bunnies, squirrels, just super, super sweet. So I bought this little set of stickers. Again, this is called the Autumn Light Washi. Let's put that, actually, let's leave that here. And then I got the Mushroom Delight stickers and they came, they come in these cute little boxes. So I will just kind of lay out the images here. Again, a lot of leaves, a lot of stick, or mushrooms, pardon me, acorns, pumpkins. I know it's fall, I know we are totally into Christmas, but Fall is all, fall images are always a good thing. And remember, you could use these for any kind of crafting that you do. If you do scrapbooking, if you do planning, if you do card making, just really, really cute. Oh, here's a couple of Christmassy ones, so I might be able to incorporate those. Anyway, I love the little empty branches. Very cute. Let me just kind of scoot that to the side. I'll put it away later. I'm probably not going to store them in these boxes because this is not an economical <laughs> or a useful way for me to store them. This next one is called the Autumn Feast. Again, look at that cute little box. We've got trees. We've got cute hedgehogs. I mean, look at that. I love that tree one. That one is kind of wintry, I think. More mushrooms. I will straight up tell you I am a sucker for sweet, cute critters. These bunnies did me in. I mean, and the deer again. I just can't. And the mushrooms. I loved those too. Fox. I thought these fall trees would be awesome for creating small little scenescapes um, on my planner spreads. Oh, look at that bear. Lots of beautiful images and critters. Okay, so I'm going to move those up here too. And again, that was called the um, Autumn Feast and the other one was Mushroom Delight. I'm going to show you a, a big set I got. This is the Polka Dot Wide Washi. So this set comes with six wide rolls. So this is going to be, let's just take a look here on my grid mat, about two and a quarter inches wide. This polka dot, oh, you guys know I'm gonna love that one. Love this. So I really, really loved the polka dot. I'll show you this one. Owls, how sweet is that? And yes, I totally tore it, so. But you could like cut this down to fit boxes. It can go across your entire spread. It could go across your card, a scrapbook page layout. Lots of ways to use the washi to adorn your spread. And then this one is some little raccoons, kind of similar to the owls. I hope you can see that. My lights are kind of causing it to be funny, I see. And then the rest are some florals. 
So we've got, I think these are probably going to be a lot more spring-ish type, but beautiful all the same. Love this. The colors are nice and subtle and so pretty. And then this is just like a blue and white, which probably could be used a little bit more um, anytime. But I think these two definitely have more of the springtime vibe and feel. So that is the polka dot wide washi is what this set is called. Then uh, the last set I bought, and I bought this because um, of this one right here. This is called Waves of Rebun. I do believe this set is on sale, but I want to show you this rolled out so you can see why I bought it. Scene building. Look at that. It does have some gold foiling. I'm not always a huge fan of foiling, just cause, mostly because it's hard to photograph. I love foiling. I love foiling cards and things, and I do use foil stickers in my planner, but oh my gosh, you guys, I just can't wait to build a scene with this. I love it. So this wide one is mostly why I bought this. This is called Waves of Rebun. I'm not exactly sure why, but whatever. And then this is like a purplish one, and I think it's supposed to be little waves as well, but they all are decorative. And it's more of a, I would say more of a rose gold foil. I really like it. I didn't know if, I mean, I'm straight up honest. I bought this set because I wanted this one. This is actually a lot prettier than I thought it would be. And then this is a little pink one. So it's just a little micro of the purple one I just opened. And I actually like it too. So really, really cute. And again, these can just be used to seal up envelopes if you want to as well. The final two things I bought are individual washies. First, we have the Diary Memory Washi. And I'm just going to roll this out. I personally love a nice subtle text washi. I don't know why, I always have, and black and white washi is my favorite. Um, again, I'm not exactly sure why that might be. Sometimes getting these started is not the most fun, but just be patient. But look how pretty. Just can be used as a nice little background element all kinds of things. I love the text. It's not legible, which I really like. And fun, just a fun little washi. Here's a little tip. I'm gonna fold just that end over. So the next time I try to use this, I'm not struggling. Then this is along the same lines of the diary memory. This is the journal memory. Let's peel it up because I wanna show you the difference between the two. And I'm just going to go along it kind of gentle like. And it's vertical. The text is vertical, you guys. How awesome is that? Like the sidebar of your planner spread, borders on cards, scrapbook pages. I love it. I love that it's vertical. So we got a horizontal and a vertical. And I'm super excited about these. I think they're going to be a lot of fun. So I'm just going to fold this one over too. I don't mind that little waste because next time I go to use this, it's going to be easier. Or when I go to use it, I haven't used any of them yet. So this is my, the washi tape haul. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this unboxing video. If you want to order anything from the washi tape, I would so love if you used my affiliate link and we will see you guys next time. Bye.